Well, here it is. It is the horror block for July, the second horror block uh, to come out yet, and uh, let's see, uh, let's see what's inside this little, this little box of joy, this little box of evil, bloody, horrific, yummy joy. Uh, as you can see, it is still sealed. Yes, still sealed. And if you notice at the bottom, it has a bunch of legal stuff about recycling and that kind of stuff. But I just, it, it caught my eye, so. Anyway, uh, let's open the bloody tape in full uh, horror movie fashion. Instead of using my handy dandy flea market knife, I'm going to be start using big kitchen knife. Very uh, Michael Myers-y. Um, you know, kind of go with the, uh, go with the whole theme here. So let's cut this bloody tape open. Kitchen knives don't work as well as the handy dandy flea market knife, but it's a horror block, so. So, yeah, horror block. Okay, anyway. Let, is, let us open the flap. The flap is open. And okay, this is this is gonna be this is gonna be fun. First of all, there is a uh, there's a Nightmare Before Christmas uh, mini figurine. Uh, it is Sally. It says so. It's not a blind figure. It, it says Sally on it. Um, when I first heard about this, I was upset because uh, this has nothing to do with horror. Um, Yes, yes, there's a Halloween town, but it's a Christmas movie that takes place in a Halloween town. It has nothing to do with horror, but, uh, since it's this little bit, that's, that's fine. Second of all, to celebrate, uh, to celebrate the, the time of, Ju of July in the year 2014, um, is the pop figure Sharknado figure, uh, uh, I'm a shark and I'm a tornado. Um, it is not the it is not the bloody San Diego Comic Con uh, exclusive. So I have this too. I have an, I have this already. So expect a giveaway. Uh, let's see. Let's see what the T-shirt is. The T-shirt is. Let's close this up. Let's close this up once more, Clarice. It is, oh my god, this is awesome. The Far Frog Brothers Vampire Hunter shirt. Uh, uh, kids, ask your parents if you don't know what the Frog Brothers are. Uh, the uh, Frog Brothers were, were uh, Corey Feldman and, uh, crap, I can't remember his other name. Uh, but anyway, they befriended Corey Haim in The Lost Boys, which had like, the second best vampires ever. I will always go on. I will always go in that Near Dark is still the best vampire movie ever. Uh, you can't have better vampires than Lance Henriksen and uh, Bill Paxton. Uh, let, let's keep going, shall we? Um, this is exciting. I'm excited now. Uh, we have a little uh, zombie, zombie keychain walking thread. Do you see that walking thread? Uh, little zombie girl there. Singer. I'm a zombie, I'm gonna eat your flesh because eating brains is only from Return of the Living Dead, which is a parody of zombies. Ah! Anyway, here's all the other ones. Oh, go slowly. 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 There we go. Okay. Now I was excited to hear about this being in here. Or this. This, uh. Intellectual property, as you will. Uh, the, the IP. Um, I'm kind of sad that this is all there is, but it's kind of cool. Uh, Aliens Buttons. Uh, I see the Waylon Lutani logo at the top there, and, and, uh, that's, that's, they're really dark. Here's a, this is an egg, um, just an open egg. That's the Alien 1 logo, uh, with the, the oozing egg. There's the chest burster, and it is not a queen, so it is just the Alien 1 egg and the face hugger. So there you go. See the face hugger? Bye. And is this last? Is this last? Have we hit the? We've hit the. We've hit the end. Last but not least is yet another issue of Rue Morgue magazine. Uh, we had this in the first box. I wonder if they're going to keep doing it. Uh, it's a really good. Like I keep saying, it's a really good horror magazine. 
Um, I love the I love the the music reviews. That's like my favorite thing because it helps me. Uh, it, it talks about um, it helps me discover uh, darker bands, more industrial bands. But it also show it also has like uh, horror movie uh, scores and stuff like how I discovered Tyler Bates and and uh, that kind of stuff. So yeah, it's uh, it's small. It's a small box. It's small, but it's fierce. Yes, uh, I'm gonna open up the Sally to show you. To show you, she's she comes in pieces. Uh, she has a she has her little she has the she has the cat in her and her little gift basket to Jack with the with the aromic stuff in it. So uh, yeah, I'm really happy about the shirt, the Frog Brother shirt. Uh, second best Lost Boys, second best vampire movie ever. Um, if you haven't seen it, then you're probably in your early 20s, or less. Uh, Sharknado Pop, definitely going to be a giveaway sometime soon, so keep your eyes open for that. And, uh, and the little zombie girl, she doesn't even have a name. Oh, wait. Yes, it is Unkind Kenneth. That's a, I guess that's a guy. That's a dude, it's Unkind Kenneth, so... I'm not even a girl! So you can't really tell for... for, uh, zombies. It's kind of shake around like Chester from Syphil and Ollie. Again, if you don't know Syphil and Ollie, then... Look up, look up, look up MTV back when it was good, so, uh... Well, anyway, uh, that's it, and, uh... We will see you for our next unboxing, so... <laughs>